Hi, hope you're well. Um, just wanted to show you um, some shopping that I've just bought. And it might be helpful if you wanted to do some shopping yourself. And um, let me just show you what I bought. And I've also pulled out of my larder some additions. And this is just great to get, get you back on track or to, if you're just doing consultation with me. Um, it's a nice starting point. So I love miso soups. So I bought two different types of miso. So this is, um, it's actually, this is a reduced salt because I've got a kidney condition, but the brown rice miso or the barley miso is rather nice, but I've gone for this reduced salt miso and Clear Spring do loads of really great products um, that you might like. So this is a darker miso. And then I've also bought um, a white miso. I like these white uh, misos because they're quite sweet and you can have it just by itself or you can mix the two, which is rather nice. So these are the miso bases for the soup. And then, well, I bought some brown rice noodles. There's no wheat or yeast in these. They're wheat and gluten free. So um, Clear Spring also do some sober noodles, but these are nice sober noodles. So I bought a couple of packs of those. And then I bought some shiitake dried mushrooms that I'll soak in some warm water. And um, they're really lovely to put in the miso as well. And then also going in my miso will be some tofu. And this tofu is from Biona. And um, it's um, a firm tofu. So I'll just cut up some cubes and put that into my miso as well and also I've got some nice organic veg so I'll make some nice sticks of carrot and some nice little florets of broccoli that's all organic as well um might put some um some little shoots in it as well this is broccoli sprouted um seed sort of uh the broccoli sprouts so these are for salads I can have these on, on my salads or just on snacks as well and then what else did I buy? I bought sauerkraut because, do you know what? I've got these sauerkraut pots and I love making sauerkraut, but it's so time consuming that I haven't made it. So I thought, do you know what? An easy win is to buy it until I do have a little bit of time and I'm going to make some more sauerkraut. But I thought, here's an easy win and buy that. Now also in with my miso, I've got a massive jar of wakame. Um, and here I've got some arame. Um, here I've got, this is kombu and nori for when I make my rice here. This is kombu and this is nori. Um, this is for different dishes. But I've got a very large, I've got a very large jar of wakame. But the arame is equally as lovely that goes uh, in. And then there's also, where's the hiziki? There's the hiziki. This hiziki is like a really nice seaweed as well that goes great with carrots, grated carrots. Um, but that also can be um, soaked and cooked and put into soups. Um, I've got, for brekkie, I've got um, some nice organic gluten-free porridge oats. And I've also got here some, these are sort of, what they called, um, unsulfured apricots. I love these. I've already opened these because they're so delish. I've um, got some oatly. And um, I've also got some seeds I'm going to toast. I'm going to toast those off. And then I'll chop that, up, chop those, uh, sorry, chop um, those up with some apples and maybe get some blueberries and put them in with my porridge in the morning with a bit of oatly and oh look I have to do have to show you Oops, sorry it's a bit messy on the floor with my um doglets but this is a really good thing to buy here's my doglets here there's one there's two and the others have been kicked out but this is really good as well this is beautiful this is um to go on my brekkie or you can put with other things that's really good so um, that rice syrup is a must as well. And what else have I got? Um, I've got lots of pulses, actually. That might be just a different video because I've got some... Um, let me just take you in, actually, while I'm doing this. Let's just have a look because I have got... There's some things in here that are for the kids. Look, 
I've got pulses. So I've got, this is, um, these are good as well. These are easy wins for um, grains. I think they're really delish. And then I've got some soup, lentils and beans and barley. Um, I've got some sushi ginger. And this is um, short grain brown rice, which is what I make for my sushi. I've got sea salt. Sea salt. This is couscous. This short grain brown rice is nice for to make with nori rolls. And then down here, again, sort of... Just a quick and easy win here is um, the Bortoloni beans. I like those in um, in a soup. I've got some, um, that's not mine. That's not mine. Um, I do live with men. This is red lentils. And then in here, I've got these, I've got these misos that I take. These are little sachets that I put in my bag if I'm going out. And then here's black beans as well. These are really, I like the black beans. They're really nice. And then popcorn for snacks. I love making popcorn. Oh, I need some more. And then here there's barley. And here is uh, flaxseed. And here's Pui lentils, green or pui, they're either green lentils or pui lentils. And this is quinoa. So these are my jars of grains. Um, I think that's it. This is, this is, the, um, this is the jar of um, wakame that I have. And then I've got shoyu as well. I've got shoyu you out here these are tomatoes grown in my garden but i've got shoyu i've got this um it's a nice sort of herby salt and then i've also got umaboshi paste that goes really nicely with um when i'm making sushi the umaboshi paste let me just have a look i've got some rice mirin that goes nice as well um, with some dressings if I'm making a nice dressing and then here is some tamari so all these ingredients are really good starters I've also got tahini that's another one that's one second here my seduction's shouting at me got some nice tahini here as well tahini with lemons and water so i've got uh, some nice uh, ingredients for dressings um i just like to make some nice dressings this is great with lemon and water beautiful and then i've got ginger grating the ginger on the special ginger grater um, with some tamari and rice mirin's really good a little bit of miso in there i have got miso this this is a miso that i found a different miso, organic white miso. It's quite strong though. So yeah, I hope that helps. Just a little introduction to some macro cooking. Um, and hopefully it helps with a bit of shopping, how to get set up. There's loads more. I mean, I could go mad with, with the shopping. This just cost me all of this sort of little shopping here. Maybe cost me about 50, 55 pounds, but our, our local shop is quite pricey. So you can certainly, thank you, Monk, Monk shouted. Um, I've also got some pumpkin seeds here. In a whole bag of, I like the, you know, pick your own rather than going to the health food shop, actually, they sort of do your own jars, but that's, um, there's a load of, oh no, there's sunflower seeds. Okay. Do that for a purpose. Oh, right, okay. Here's my husband, he's just come home and the dogs have been kicked out. So I hope that helps with a bit of shopping. But yeah, if you're looking at around 50, 50 pounds, 55 pounds, maybe a bit more to get set up. And um, if you've got any questions, and we'll discuss about your menu and your recipes and what to get. And um, we can get you set up and sorted. So I hope that helps. <laughs> and I'll talk to you soon.